Tutup lupa aja. Just want to make something clear, this time I won't go into details about each ability and instead will make a how to robin video in future. For now I'll just keep it simple and talk about some synergies focusing on this build. Let's talk about your survivability first. Your main tool is the armor buff from Bastille giving you 1000 extra armor. With robin prime's base of 200 that adds up to 1200 which if you didn't know is equivalent to 80% damage reduction and with adaptation on top of that it will be 98% damage reduction. If you want to go plus ultra then add arcane guardian and you will reach 98.75% damage reduction. So yeah, he's 20 tanky now and with the amount of CC he has, it's fair to say, you won't have too much trouble surviving. Especially if you add something like Magus Repair to your operator as well. Main gameplay loop is, you see a bunch of enemies, you drop your brass seal and start building up your armor buff. If there's a lot of them after you build up your armor buff, just hold forward to turn your brass seal into a vortex and drop a flechette orb next to your vortex and just walk away. If enemies were armored, they lost a portion if not all of their armor in Bastille making them easy kills. Flechette orb is no joke, like god damn. And if they're shielded units, Vortex will cause magnetic procs making their shields take up to 4.5 times the damage. But my weapons don't do enough damage. Not to worry, Robin got you covered. Just drop override and you will get 25% extra damage on base and yes it is multiplicative. It also happens to stack with your passives extra damage. So if enemies are CC'd by you, you will get 50% extra damage while override is active. Oh yeah, also forgot, override affects full shot orbs as well. I'm in an open space and I'm afraid I will get flagged. Again, Robin got you covered. Just hold one and drop four Tesla Nervos and you can forget about them because they do their own thing and they don't get destroyed by anything. They just die whenever they use all 20 of their shocks. What is it again? I see two enemies and I don't want to waste 100 energy to drop my 4. Not to worry, Robin got you covered. Again, just drop a tether coil for only 25 energy. Once you kill the affected targets, it'll grab more. Now let's have a look at some footage, shall we? In the sky, gazing far into the night, I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use, cause you can't stop it from shining through, it's true, baby let the light shine through, if you believe it's true, baby won't you let the light shine through.
in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use, cause you can't stop it from shining through. It's true, baby, let the light shine through. If you believe it's true, baby, won't you let the light 